What is happening, y'all? It's your boy Q Monster here, back at it once again. I'm about to go ahead and give you my review for the Lucky Episode 1. Man, oh man, oh man. I've been waiting on this. I've been waiting for this show, man. You already know your boy been waiting on it. And I must say that this episode, man, shh, woo, this episode was good. I ain't going to lie. Loki episode one was good. I mean, it definitely shows a whole lot what's going on. You know what I'm saying? The MCU. You know what I mean? So, there's a lot going on. So, I'm going to go ahead and do review. Uh, don't know if I might do... Well, I don't want to spoil anything. Well, I'm going to spoil one thing. And I hope everybody did see, uh, you know... Avengers Endgame. This is where I mean, this is where it takes place. You know what I'm saying after the Endgame. So I hope everybody has seen the Endgame. So from the beginning of the show, I mean, I mean the beginning of this episode and everything, it shows what happened in the past. You know what I'm saying in the uh, the Avengers Endgame. You know how uh, Loki escaped and everything with the Tesseract. That's how it all started. So. That's one spoiler right there that I'm going to give out. Just just that one. <laughs> so I hope everybody did see Endgame because, I mean, I just spoiled that one for you. So that's it. But now I'm going to go ahead and get on to the rest of this episode. So uh, this is going to be spoiler free for the rest of this episode now. I only just gave out one spoiler, you know what I'm saying, for Endgame. So, but yeah. So pretty much... You know, this is not the Loki that we know from the Infinity War that, you know, that died by Thanos' hand when he got choked out and all that stuff. So, this Loki is from all the way for 2012, you know what I'm saying, from the first, the first Avengers movie. You know what I'm saying, when Loki was the enemy at that time, you know what I'm saying, facing all the Avengers. So, so this Loki had not re-experienced what the other Loki have throughout the whole entire, you know, MCU uh, franchise, you know what I mean? Okay, like you know, you got Loki from the Dark World and uh, <clears throat> Loki from Ragnarok, you know, and uh, Loki from the um, Infinity War. Yeah, those are the Lokis that we saw in the past in the movies, you know, in the Marvel movies. So, so like I said, this is like the old Loki that has not experienced anything from the you know, future Loki, you know, so, it's a whole different ball game from him, so, so this is the Loki that was fresh off, you know what I'm saying, getting his ass whooped by the Hulk, which he's still pissed off about that, <laughs> so, somehow he got transported, transported to this, uh, time, time loop, well, I mean, yeah, he was stuck in a time loop, that he got transported to this whole different area. I don't know what it is. Some kind of desert that he got into and everything. So he got uh he got thrown into that. And then um he ran into the timekeepers. You know what I'm saying? The keeper of the keeper of time. You know, they trying to like, you know, stay on track of everything, what's going on in the in the timelines and everything, you know what I'm saying? They these timekeepers, you know what I'm saying, they the one who maintain the timelines. So after seeing Loki, you know what I'm saying, Loki's a problem to them, you know, because Loki escaped his timeline from the 2012 Avengers, you know what I'm saying, from his timeline. So, that was not supposed to happen, you know what I'm saying, so, the timekeepers did not like that, so, you know, so Loki kind of crossed the line on that one, you know what I mean, so, yeah, not good, not good. But anyways, you know, um... Like, from the main story of this, you know what I'm saying? I mean, like, you know, the timekeeper is trying to have this Loki, you know, trying to, like, you know, help them out to, uh, you know, keep the timeline good so that way nothing don't screw up. Because right now they got, like, these other alternate Lokis that are out and about, you know, and they over just, like, you know, just wrecking havoc all over the timeline. So... They need the 2012 Loki, you know what I'm saying, to put a stop on them. That's what they need. So, 
So yeah, that's gonna be a main mission right there. So yeah. <laughs> but um like I said, I mean I did enjoy the show. It did not bore me at all. You know what I'm saying? I mean, like I said, plus it shows a lot of Easter eggs and like I said, reference from the other Avengers movie and everything and other Thor movies and all that stuff that Loki was in and everything and all that stuff, so yeah. So yeah, this show was pretty good. I did enjoy it. You know what I'm saying? Cannot wait for episode two. So, um, yeah, I wouldn't have to spend too long on this video. Just want to go ahead and give you my review on it. I'm going to give this episode one uh, 10 out of 10. You know what I'm saying? Because I really did like it. I really did enjoy it. There was some action. A lot of good action. You know what I'm saying? A lot of comedy. You know, hey, it's Loki. You know what I'm saying? Because Loki, he, hey, he's funny. He's hilarious. So... Yeah, they're gonna be some jokes here and there from him and all that stuff. So, but you know, like I said, you got uh, what's the name? Owen. Um, got his last name. Forgot the dude's last name, but yeah, Owen and Tom Hiddleston. Tom Hiddleston doing a good job, man. I'm, I'm glad that he's staying with this character. You know what I'm saying? Because he know how to play this character, and that's why I like you know with these actors. You know what I'm saying? That's like you know staying, you know playing as their characters throughout every movie you know what i'm saying so i'm i'm proud about i'm proud of him about that so yeah tom hiddleston he know what he's doing i i give him the man props you know what i'm saying he's portraying this character loki character so keep doing your thing tom hiddleston like i said i am enjoying your show and you know like i said i cannot wait for episode two so post your comments down below i really know, i really want to know what y'all think did y'all ever get to uh, have a chance to watch episode one of loki if not, go ahead and check it out. You know what I'm saying? The episode is already out right now on Disney+. Plus, So feel free to go ahead and check it out and give me your thoughts on it down below. And um, if you enjoyed my review, make sure you hit that like button. And always, subscribe it and share it. I'm going to catch you guys later. Deuces!